please welcome Archbishop Desmond Tutu. Do you know something? You are members of one family. Please, please behave as members of one family. Friday, a 14-year-old girl was shot in the foot as she stood outside this of this video is, office. as Nancy said, upsetting and very difficult to watch. This is ridiculous. This needs to stop. I'm getting tired of it. In May 2010, the Chicago Bar Association and WICC joined efforts to produce a town hall meeting on youth violence. The issue is that guns is in our community. I was a victim of gun violence. You know, I was shot and paralyzed. It's not just about shooting someone else and taking another life. We did not birth murderers. Because you all really don't want to deal with the reality. It's a win-win situation for me, so I'm going to keep my gun. We need to do something more than talk, and I'm really tired of talking. We need to get rid of the hoods and create more actual neighborhoods. When you drop neighbor off, you know, what do you communicate? When a child gets killed, whether it's in Englewood or whether it's in Woodlawn, a child is a child. Every child is every one of our children. One, two, three. We did dance and drumming and chorus. It doesn't start at 15 anymore. It doesn't start when you get in high school. It's time to start bringing that home value to the program. I started gang banging when I was around 15 years old. I have a passion for working with you. And one of the best assets we have is people. Ideally, I would want to reach to every kid. In a world where public opinion is shaped by ratings-driven media, we decided to showcase the other side of the coin. But soon enough, we realized that wasn't enough. Now, do we have any potential lawyers in here? Ladies and gentlemen, how's the jury? My name is Lenise Hills, and I represent Chandra. My name is Guy Stevens. I will be representing Joe Swag and Lisa Liverbell. Ah, great, great. Our goal is universal. We understand that it's one community at a time. Learning directly from the people and inspired by Archbishop Tutu's philosophy, we started our own program on restorative justice. We're in danger. They put us all in hell and they expect angels. We became better listeners to the young people's issues of what was actually going on with them. What would you tell us to do different? Everything else is good. We should have more time. Yeah, like she said, more time. They gained hope. They built up confidence in themselves. They discovered some of their talents. Go for the question. We've never given restorative justice concepts an opportunity to succeed. I just like the fact that we learn a different way of solving a problem instead of fighting. It's so moving. WYCC and the Chicago Bar Association, moving our community forward.